last time I've seen a wheelie bar was in 2002. The last time I've ridden a wheelie bar was in 2002. And the reason why that was the last time I rode a wheelie bar was I ate pure, I shot out so hard and it hit my elbows so hard that I never wanted to feel that experience again. But as you guys know on this channel, I'm a fiend for old scooter parts. I'm a fiend for old scooters. I'm a fiend for contraptions and things and experiments on scooters because I like the challenge. And the reason why I brought this back out because the last time I rode this, I got hurt and it sucked. And I want to square up with it again. I want a round two with the wheelie bar. This is a Razor wheelie bar. You can see on the screen, this is what it comes in. I found this thing on eBay. I remember that these things existed years back. And the intentions of the wheelie bar were to wheelie, to make it easier to wheelie, to press on it, kill weight, and do more manual tricks. And I think of almost 20 years of progression after never using the wheelie bar again. Today's the day we get a round two. And the goal for today is to get 10 tricks by using just the wheelie bar. Your boy is a mechanic at its best. I got this thing on, super solid, as if it was made by Envy, and this thing's ready to go. It's supposed to fit on the Razor, but I use it on my Flatland School, you can see. Your boy is the mechanic of the year. And if you aren't subscribed to the channel, subscribe because we're uploading three full videos every week and a shorts video every other day. A full video is not out, so basically new videos every single day on the channel. So subscribe, have notifications on, be the first to see it. Let's get 10 tricks using the scooter wheelie bar. Hey. Championship game. Dream team. Feeling better than I ever been. Cairo in his bag, this beat is heaven sin. Back up in my element. New whip, trunk up in the front. I whip an elephant. It's all limo tent. That's how you move when you the president. You ass and off stream. Treat them like my last name. Disrespecting, you just signed a check for a long day. Appetizer rappers, you will never be an entree. There are some projects that I start the video. And in my head, I'm like, oh, this is gonna be very easy. I feel like I'm gonna be able to do a lot of tricks. Before I started filming, I believe this would feel very similar to back pegs. And you guys know I'm pretty decent with back peg tricks. It's not, it's so much harder, it's so much sensitive. And the little bar that's on the back is so thin. So let's say I am standing on this. This is not a peg. This is so tiny. My toes are getting tortured. What the hell? That's so weird. How many tricks are we at? I'm gonna say four. If I did more than four, then I'm not gonna count whatever was more than four, but we're gonna be at four right now. I wasn't expecting it to be this hard. This wheelie bar is supposed to make wheelies easier. And I'll tell you that pegs do that for me. And anytime I have an experiment, I wanna see if there are tricks that I can do and only can do on the experiment. Most of the time, the experiment is different. It's tough, it breaks or you can learn things that you just normally can't do on your regular scooter, which is always a goal of mine. So hopefully we can come up with some ideas with the next six tries of trying tricks and come up with something cool that we can post on Instagram, we can post on TikTok, and that is a new trick for this channel. Uh, I'm gonna have arthritis in my feet tomorrow and my feet already hurt from running flat every day I do have to take breaks you guys don't know if I ride flat very hard for three days in a row My feet are destroyed my toes hurt my ankle hurts just standing on a tiny little peg for hours Does a lot of damage. I was not prepared for this when I started to get into flatland this thing this little nub in the back It's even smaller than an axle and that's what makes it very painful. But I feel like it only makes sense to end this with doing a trick off the wheelie bar. We basically did a bunch of different manuals, fakie manuals, mega spins. We understand how to balance it a little bit. Really hard because it's tough because your foot usually goes in the wheel right here, which makes things very difficult because you gotta be more on your toes, which makes it more painful. I gave it some thought and I wanna see if I can do a manual or mega spin or something where I'm on the wheelie bar and straight whip. I feel like it's gonna be very painful to be behind your scooter on something the size of an axle. Put all your body weight and then whip. You guys are here, we built this, it worked, feels solid. 
Did video banger. Didn't even plan on this. The video, I actually finished filming the video. I'm adding this clip in the middle of the video because I was trying to do this. I wanted to do manual whip at the end, which we'll get to right after. But like I said, this is technically after the video is done and I was just playing around. Let me see, let me figure things out before I pack up. Hold on, wait a second. I don't know what that's called, like a skateboard manual? The world's first on a scooter, your boy? Yes, we did it. I don't know how that works. Very weird because only one wheel, but you guys saw what just happened. Thanks to the wheelie bar, we're able to do a trick that you can't do in your regular scooter, and we have succeeded. Now let's continue the video. You never know when there'll be a mid-video banger like this. And now we'll go back into the past, which is the regular time for you guys. We have one more trick planned that you'll love to see. You guys watch these videos for a reason, and that's to see me do my best, and that's the plan. Manual, whip, straight off the wheelie bar. <laughs> By far, the hardest manual whip I've ever done in my entire life. With all the contraptions, all the experiments, all the different tricks, the different variations of doing manual whips, this was definitely the most painful and the hardest. This wheelie bar was from the year 2000 probably. We brought it back. We were able to get this on the scooter perfectly as if Envy makes it for the deck. But obviously this is for a Razor. This is a Razor wheelie bar. We brought it back and we made some tricks happen. If you guys are interested in more experiments, give me ideas. Shoot me links of things I should order and try to mod my scooter and challenge myself. That's the whole point of this. I love the challenge. I had a bone to pick with this one because the last time I used it, I destroyed both my elbows because I looped out so hard that I had double swell bow that day and never wanted to use it again until today. Putting the wheelie bar to rest. If you guys enjoyed this, please subscribe to the channel, hit notifications, leave a comment, talk about something cool in the comments. Like I said, give me some ideas in the comments below. If you have experiment ideas, Shoot me a link to a website you think, hey John, you should order this, spend money and buy this. Maybe it'll work, maybe it won't. I'll try it. That was very painful, but fun. And that's it for me. Thank you once again, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Feeling better than I ever been. Cairo in his bag, this beat is heaven sin. Back up in my element. New whip, trunk up in the front, I whip an elephant. It's so